Hi, it's Andrea Pudding here with Business Soul Food. Now, according to a recent study conducted by Michael Henderson, a corporate anthropologist, 7 out of 10 businesses aren't achieving their full potential. Now, that's a lot of businesses and a big figure to take in. So what is happening? The causes business with so much enormous potential to slump into a stagnant survival mode rather than forging ahead into the enormous pool of opportunity. Now there are a few things that seem to happen here. First of all, they lose touch with the soul of their business, the core mission. Why is it that they start the business in the first place? Now of course building a business is a very intense experience and it you can become quickly overcome with the day-to-day -day running of the business. And the focus becomes just getting through the day, reaching those sales figures and ensuring that products go out on time. But employees can only focus on their task at hand and often become disenchanted with their work as they go day in, day out, same old thing. As the research shows, from Gallup that 75% of Australians are disengaged or disinterested in the workplace. We have a real problem here. How can a business really grow and be innovative in this environment? When employees feel a deep connection with the purpose of the business and their work, they are more engaged and more interested in what they are doing. Let's continue. In desperations to move things along, old and outdated models of business are implemented. These do nothing to create an atmosphere where employees feel they can contribute to making the business grow. In fact, it does the opposite. People feel untrusted and stifled. They are unable to grow and develop. They don't contribute what they have to offer because frankly it doesn't feel safe. All in all this leads a business to have no drive in being innovative. It gets businesses stuck and they have no growth or just marginal growth occurring. And so the question is, is it time to awaken the soul of your business? Get back in touch with what that true calling is for you and your business. It is called to be more, so much more. There is an emerging future that wants to awaken and come forth into the world. Now get your team on board, step back together and look at the whole picture. Listen to the future and take action to where your business can live out its highest future potential. Create for yourself and your employees a great legacy and become a social movement that people love.